Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me for today's video. I definitely want to suggest making yourself a cup of coffee or tea or grabbing some water so you can sit down and enjoy this fall decor haul since this one is going to be quite a long one. So again, just sit down and enjoy. I hope you guys like everything that I got. Bury yourself beneath stone. Hello everyone, welcome to today's fall decor haul. I'm so excited to share with you guys everything that I have gotten and today is going to be a pretty big decor haul so I hope you guys took my advice and made yourself a cup of coffee, iced coffee, tea, water, whatever you drink so that way you can sit down and enjoy this haul with me. But without much rambling, I just want to go ahead and get started with the haul. I have a lot of exciting items I want to share with you guys. And yeah, let's go ahead and get started with the haul. Okay, so the first two items I want to show you guys are something that I've been wanting to get for quite some time. But I just felt a little bit weird spending money on something like this. I don't know why, but this is going to be it. Let me see if it fits in the frame. But basically, it is a framed picture of Jonathan and I. I actually have two. I'll show you guys the other one in just a minute. I got these from Smallwood Home, I believe. And I've been debating printing out pictures of Jonathan and I this size because, I don't know, there's just something about putting a picture of Jonathan and I that it's that is this huge in our house but I finally decided to go for it Jonathan is the one that convinced me actually so I did go ahead and I print this one out let me see if I can show you guys exactly what it looks like but it is beautiful I got this I got these pictures taken of us last year and I absolutely love them and I feel like they will fit perfectly with my fall decor so I got this one printed as well as this one right here and I did get them stained and I believe the option I picked was 25 inches by 17 inches. They actually were not that expensive. I got them for $29 each because they were running like a promo or a sale on them. But I, like I said, I have been wanting to do it for quite a while. So I had been checking like every other week and they always have some type of promotion. So I definitely recommend checking them out. And I know this is something like a piece of decor that is personal, but it is an idea if you guys have some nice fall pictures that you can incorporate into your fall decor, you can definitely get like get them custom printed like that. But next up, I have a few items from Joann's that I want to show you guys. I just got two things there, but the first one is this amber glass vase. This is huge. I've been, I had been looking for a big amber glass jar. I actually looked at the one from Target, which I believe is like maybe this size or a little bit smaller, but it was $25. So it was just a little bit more expensive than what I wanted to spend on it. Whereas this one was actually $29.99, but it was 60% off at Joann's, so it was cheaper than the one at Target. So I decided to go with it. And at Joann's as well, I got this piece of greenery, which is actually orangery, I guess. <laughs> well, you know, because it's orange, whatever. I guess I'm the only one that got that joke. But anyways, um, I got this. I actually got another one, but I'm already using it in my decor, so I didn't want to pull it out. But this one was $3.99 and it was 50% off. So I got two for about $4. And I absolutely love it. I love the color of it and it matches the decor I want to go with this time around. Okay, next up I want to share with you guys the only pieces that I did end up getting from Amazon this time around. And you guys might have been able to guess this, but I got pillow covers. So I just got the pillow cover. I did put like my um, feather inserts in them. But I got these orange like velvety ones. They did come in a pack of two. The other one's already sitting on the couch. But these, this pack of two, this orange color, I think it was like $13 or $12 for two pillowcases, which is definitely way less expensive than buying a $25 pillow. So I have decided that I am going to go with pillowcases in most cases when I'm decorating. I did get one pillow that, again, you guys might be able to guess which one it is because basically every YouTuber has hauled it, but 
I got this these pillowcases from Amazon as well as these ones right here these are absolutely beautiful and I absolutely just love the pattern and how neutral they are. I finally decided to replace the like cream checkered ones that I had used in the past, I don't even know, like probably a year. I think I got them last year in the fall, but I finally decided to replace them and I got these ones and I got these on a major deal. So it was two pillow covers for, I believe I paid like $9 and something for both of them because they had a 20% coupon, but regularly they are like 12 or $13 as well. And again, I just have a feather pillow insert inside of them and the other one is sitting on the couch. Okay, you guys, so I have a few more items from Hobby Lobby and Target to share with you guys as well. So make sure you stay till the end of this video. But now I want to go ahead and share with you guys a very special, I guess, gift that I received by a subscriber who reached out to me, letting me know that she is starting her own candle company and she wanted to send me her whole autumn collection. So I want to show you guys real quick what it looks like. So this is one of the boxes in her collection there is a total of three boxes this is the thanksgiving one and oh my god you guys so each box comes with three candles i don't want to like throw them and break them but this is what they look like i'll try to insert like a close-up video of them but this is like i said her thanksgiving collection she also sent me her let me close it <laughs> She also sent me her, her Enchanted collection, which is for Halloween. So this is what the box looks like. It's absolutely beautiful. Her brand, as you guys can see, is called Cozy Me Candles. And again, it comes with three candles. She also sent some cute little stickers. Look at that. It comes with three candles. Ugh, if you guys can see. And the last box that she sent me is her sweater weather collection and this is what that box looks like so it is absolutely beautiful i love them all and you guys i just thought it was such a unique idea so she explained how her business is going to run and essentially she is launching collections seasonally like i said this was her autumn collection and each collection will come with three different boxes and you can purchase the boxes individually her company or her official launch isn't until september 3rd but i you guys i wanted to try these candles out for you guys and i can honestly say i absolutely love them and my favorite collection is going to be the thanksgiving collection i just love every scent in here and another interesting thing about it is they are wood wick candles and i had never had a wood wick candle so i was pretty intrigued this is what they look like they're absolutely beautiful they're more of that like bath and body works type of candle or look if that's what you're going for they're just very simple you can also use the other side take the label off which by the way the label is absolutely beautiful it is also like printed it's just so so pretty and i already burned this one you guys because i wanted to see how the scent was and honestly my house smelled of warm blueberry pumpkin pie when i lit this one up so i'm honestly very impressed and you guys have heard me talk about small businesses a lot on my channel because i really truly believe in supporting them because as you guys know my husband has his small business as well and i know that they're like babies and I even get emotional because just looking at her work you guys I I'm just impressed by the amount of time and attention to detail I see in the packaging in the candles in the scents and everything she also sent me over these like chocolate melts which are like wax melts that I can put over in my wax warmer and again you guys I'm absolutely in love with it she also sent this like cute little um heart which is a like a sneak peek of the next collection scents so again I absolutely love it I will leave her link down below she's launching September 3rd like I said but you guys can put your email into her website and get notified when it launches as well as receive 10% off of your next 
of your order if you decide to order and a free um, chocolate melt which is awesome and if you're watching this video after her launch and that is no longer an option you can use the code cas 10 to get 10% off of your orders I'm not making anything off of it that is just something she wanted to offer you guys in case she is no longer offering the 10% off on her site so yeah definitely check her out she's so incredibly sweet I absolutely love all of the candles they all smell super super good and I'm just in love I have them all around my house and I'm so excited to be able to help a small brand small company start up so yeah I definitely recommend you guys go check her out put your email in if it's not September 3rd yet when you're watching this video but I did want to go ahead and share those with you so let's go ahead and move on to the rest of the decor Okay, so next up is Target and I only have a few items from a Target left to share with you guys and actually <laughs> Actually, you might not be a few items. I do have a little bit more than a few items. But anyways, that is not the point here. Um, you guys already know when I shop at Target, I shop Hearth and Hand. I absolutely love that line. And I just couldn't give up some of these pieces. So I did make my way back there and I grabbed them. And the first one, like I said, is one that you've probably seen in a lot of hauls. And that is this beautiful burnt orange pillow with the little tassels i absolutely love this i love the color it's not like an actual like burnt orange it's more of like a like orangey brown let me show you guys a comparison so this pillow is a burnt orange and this is the target pillow so you guys can see the difference this is just a little bit brighter than this one is but I love it combined with those pillows and this was a $20 at Target like I said and to go with it I also got the throw blanket which I am sitting on and it is this one right here it's just a nice creamy white color with that same like I think they call it pumpkin brown or pumpkin orange, something like that color right here. I just think that obviously these two paired together is going to look really good on the couch. So I went ahead and I grabbed those and then I also grabbed, oh, sorry, I have a lot of stuff. I also grabbed the amber glass candle holders. I really wasn't going to grab them. I convinced myself that I didn't need them, that I had enough amber glass in my house. But then I seen so many people haul them that I felt even more in love with them. So I went to Target and I told myself if they're there, I'll grab them. If they're not, I'm not going to grab them this season. But they were there, so I had to grab them. And the small one is $4.99 and the larger one was a $7.99. And I absolutely love them. I'm planning to use them on my um, console table underneath my TV. And obviously to go with them, I got some candles. And I did get the ones that, again, Hearth and Hand sells. They actually come connected, which I thought was pretty cool. But I already took them out of their packaging. Both of them were, I believe, $4.99, I want to say, or $3.99. I'll put the correct price down here. But yeah, I just got these to go with the little candle holders. Okay, so before I get to my Hobby Lobby items, I totally forgot that I had one thing from Walmart, which is a very simple thing, but it is these birch logs. I really was looking for something like this to incorporate into my console table so i found these at walmart for i want to say it was ten dollars so not too bad not the cheapest and as my sister said i could probably walk outside and find some logs off of my tree or something but i'm just a little bit iffy about doing that with when it comes to wood because of termites i live in new mexico so termites are definitely a thing in like trees so i just decided to go the safe route and buy these and again they were ten dollars so i figured why not there's something that i really want to incorporate into my decor so I decided to go for it and that actually leads me to the next item which will start the items that I got from Hobby Lobby and that is more sticks <laughs> so exciting I know but these are actually like very long 
um, I want to say maybe like four feet and it does come with like a lighter birch one and then it comes with two like darker sticks I don't know and this was a $15.99 I did use my 40% coupon so I got it for around eight dollars or like nine something like that and again I'm just trying to incorporate this into my fall decor so I thought why not I will find a place for it I'm thinking against the wall or something so you guys will definitely have to stay tuned to see my decorating videos but yes I got that from Hobby Lobby as well as a few more items so this next item I also told myself I was not gonna get because everybody has gotten them but every time I went to Hobby Lobby I found myself putting them in my cart taking them out putting them in my cart taking them out so I finally just got them and they are these cute little wooden spoons <laughs> they are these cute little wooden spoons with like the little um pumpkin top on them they're so cute these were 9.99 40% off and I already opened them because I already decorated my coffee bar but I did want to share them with you guys before sharing that video and yeah I just thought that they were so cute next up I just got this like galvanized bucket you guys know that I usually like hanging stuff on my kitchen rods so I thought this would be perfect for that and it was $11.99 but it was 50% off so I got it for $6 and I just like that it has like the darker edges because it just brings in the darker warmer tones that I want to incorporate into my fall decor so that's perfect and then this napkin right here I actually I can't believe that I like passed it up so many times I actually can't remember seeing it until the last time I went to Hobby Lobby but I absolutely love this burnt orange color it was $6.99 40% off and I love it it does also have the little um where is it this like a little thing right here to hang it like on a peg rail or a hook or something or you can just fold it up and hang it as usual so that is super cute and then I also got this corbel 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 I think that's what it's called I just really like it I like the like wood tone of it it's so easy to add like a wood element into my decor or like a little setup that I have going on so this was $13.99 and I did get it 50% off and I just think it's a good like piece to add to your seasonal decor just to bring in some of that wood element like I said and then I did get a few more pumpkins because after I actually decorated, I found myself needing a few more pumpkins. So that is why I got just a few more. Not a lot. But I got a green one. Actually, I got two green ones. I already took the pick out of this one. But these were $2.99, 40% off. I just like how like real they look. And then I got this one, which is, again, a pick. This one was $5.99, a bit more expensive than I thought it would be. I honestly thought I was paying the same amount I was for these. But nonetheless, it's okay. It's super cute, and it's just like that burnt orange color. And then I got one more of these, like, braided ones, and I got, got it in, like, the white color. This one was $11.99, 40% off. And I got a few more picks. So I got these like greenery picks right here just because I didn't want to purchase like the big um, eucalyptus, um, dried eucalyptus that I purchased last time because I knew exactly what I was going to use these for and I didn't need that much. So I just went ahead and went with these ones and these were $3.99 each. And lastly, the last and final item that I purchased at Hobby Lobby was this basket right here. I absolutely think this is a, so cute and it uses a lot of like that twine element that I have going on in my decor. And you guys will see when I upload my decorating videos next week. I really love how I incorporated different like textures, patterns, elements, and so on into my decor. So this was a last minute pick that I purchased to just tie all of that in over in my kitchen. So I really love this. This was $12.99 and yeah, that's what I'm thinking I'm going to use these for is just to put in there. But as I said, that was my last item for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm honestly 
so excited that I finally have everything for my decorating videos and I love how everything came out because like I just said I already decorated but I wanted to show you guys these last final decor items that I purchased for my decorating so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this haul if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you are new don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss my upcoming decorating videos I'm so excited to share them with you guys and yeah i would really appreciate it if you subscribe if you are new and until then i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day i will see you guys next week in my next decorating video bye let me be a part of some